Hi there, it's Kevin. And Zach. We've got our games. We have Paul with our first one. We're going to be opening up more of these as time goes on. Unfortunately, we did not receive all of our VIPs. So for those of you who wanted us to open up uh, VIPs, we are short at the moment. So we're going to get to those. And then we'll open yours. Bacon Bombs, you're 16. We'll get those opened for a video. But we have Paul. This one's simple enough. Just wants this sucker opened and showcased. Let's see if we can crack those Force of Wills and not Fatal Pushes. So... After this, we also have Duck Butters with an entire box and a Ooh. Double Masters. So here we go on this sucker. Let's try to be nice. I guess we don't have to be nice to this box that can be resealed. It's just huh? a box. It's a terrible box. This is what we've come to. This well, is what the world has come to. $100 boxes. Yeah. Uh, well, $100 pack boxes. Which was supposed to go for $125. I don't know why people are still arguing with me about this stuff, but that's where MSRP would be if Wizards of the Coast wasn't chicken and got rid of MSRP because they know half their products could never sell for MSRP. Yeah. So... Paul paid $75 for this if you're a patron. That's what you pay for. Um, that's how much the distributor costs for this beautiful, shiny Double Masters VIP edition is. And it's it's been averaging around uh, 95 to 100 bucks well, on eBay. Well, you got to open it on whatnot. camera. Oh, yeah. you got to make sure I'm not uh, ripping people off here I... with the resealable Double Masters. How are Maybe. people resealing these, though? I don't Heating know. Heating it, and then it comes off. I mean, I we, you could try that. Yeah, but... whatever. It'll, it looks but so my, my biggest, uh, Yeah, exactly. You could reseal and, a booster box at that point. My problem is, is who's, who can seal these back up? Yeah, I know. So Well, they I, can search. Can they search it at all? No? Uh, yes, you can. You can slide it up oh. and see what and see cards what. what. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, I see what they're saying. All right, um, so let us go ahead and get to this. And then we will open up some, the one for uh, Mr. Duck Butter, Senior Duck Butter. So the first one we have the Sanctum, the Salvating, the Frogify, Strength of Arms, Mirror Retriever, Ooh. Costly Plunder. This one, uh, Mirror Retriever is going to be fun for Popper for Downshift. Oh, was it the, Downshifted? Yep, I believe so. so. I don't think it was ever a common before. Clear Shot, Accomplish Automaton, uh, the Volshock Gauntlets. The Sandstone Oracle in the Uncommons Weapons Ooh, Trainer. Oh, I know they should have downshifted it. Can you pioneer it? It's one that? of the cards I want them to downshift. But can you still mm. pioneer? Is it even playable? Well, it'd just be another run of the bill aggro deck. Yeah, so that's true. I don't true. know if it'd be better. What makes Mono Black so good is it's just as aggressive, yeah. plus it's got their resilience. Uh, the Uvalde Mysteries, the Vampire Hex Mage, the uh, Yavimai's Embrace. Which they downshift from rare, but I thought they did another set too. They downshifted that from rare. I'm not for Ash sure. Ash Barons, which they upshifted from a common to an uncommon. I think they did another in Master 25 as well, though. The Sarah Sphinx, the Basalt, Basalt Ma. That's a great pull. This card tends to recover very, very well. Uh, oh, no. Ooh. Starting off four with the duplicate. Too many printings. And oh, the Champion wow. Lambolds. So yeah. another one we saw open had this exact same run. Really? Yes, duplicate the, the so, champion. So they're the exact. That is huh. stupid. Huh. So. Okay. So. All right. <laughs> Paul. Wow. Paul, we um, apologize. Get get your. We apologize. Uh, common, get, get get your common okay. rare. It's out of the way. Power plant. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Don't do this to us. Oh. oh wow. <laughs> kicked. Kicked. Actually, we're supposed to hype these up. What a great commander card! This can to... put out, this can mill your opponents, which they probably want to get done in a hundred cards. I, I think deck. it's time we revise the reserve <laughs> list. Anything not printed in uh, standard in 2020 is now on the reserve list. So this is oh. what thing we need to do. Why not? Why? It's Cause, cause <laughs> so we have the sword of body and mind, which is one of the worst mythics we could have pulled. But, I mean, great card. Awesome sword. People love swords. And we have nice. the regular art ones. And then we should have two foils. Oh, no. Oh, so um, they're different. They have like five of each, I believe. Oh, okay. And then we have the foil mountain from the un-whatever set and the swamp. Ooh. So, Sapperling cool. and treasure with angel and servo. Sweet. Well, there you go, Paul. There. Yep. There you have it. So, gamble. Bit of a gamble there. And Paul's never going to trust us ever again. So, let's get on to the Duck Butter. Duck Butter has this Double Masters. We'll get this one going, and then Zach and I will rotate with the packs. Maybe we'll go kind of slow with the packs. And like I said, we'll get to Bacon Bomb's massive 16 VIPs when, Give me whenever Paul's we get them. Cheat. Uh, so we can know who it goes to. Yes. Paul doesn't want you. He wants you to mix it up with Duck Butters here. He wants us to forget and then just kind of make some video evidence now, though. Yeah. 
lame. All right, so these things are kind of annoying to open because they just, I guess they're not bad. All right, so we have, I wonder if people also, when they have runs, if they can see what it will be if they do uh, come in specific runs. So I've also yeah. ordered the invite VIP packs like Manamorphose and Bobble are in the every pack together right next to each other. Not crazy if they are. So here we have the Alabaster Mage. Teamer Battle Rage, very good card. Uh, Gravian Restoration, another card that's interesting in Popper. I believe it's the first time it's been a common. The Sanctum Gargoyle. The Sylvan Might. Uh, Acre Wellspring. Cast Down, which is going to be amazing in Popper. It's going to be the go-to removal oh, spell. Oh, downshifted. So these they are all going on MTGO. print this in every master set. Let's just put yeah, it in another one. True. Jeez. All these designers have their pet cards, and they just can't get away from them. The Metal Spinner's Puzzle Work. Uh, the Core Tapper. The Hidden Stockpile. That would have been fun if it would have been downshifted. Uh, but it was not. Invigorate, which is banned in Popper. Uh, Sphinx of the Guild Pack. Brimstone Volley, which they upshifted. Kind of weird upshift. Uh, Golem Artisan, the Glass Dust Hulk, and Woodland Champion. Now, the first rare is a upshifted Sword of the Meek, which eh, hopefully can hold somewhat value in that. It's got the Thopter combo, which is still very fun in Popper or in and Standard. Vexing oh. Shusher. Ooh, ouch. That's another yeah. card pull. We're doing battle on these VIPs. There's a good one oh, for you, though. There we go. Exploration. One of the better rares to get. So the rare slot on this one is very, very juicy. I think this one's around 35 right now. It's really hit hard already because these are... Oh, and a car wow. Liberated. So we did yeah, we did they... Duck Butter a lot better than we did Paul. Yeah, but um, that thing's going to be worth 50 cents because no one wants to touch it. That art. Yeah. That ugly, ugly art. But yeah. at least the artist is standing by it. He's like, I like my art, which is good for him. Yeah, good, good for him. This one but... is kind of darkish on the like the foiling yeah, doesn't it is stand kinda out. Kind of dark. Huh? They're like matte or something. Yeah, but this one stands out. Yeah, that one, that looks, one looks good. good. This one kind of has like a darker. Well, I don't when you know. You have really light colors trying to. All be right, foil. so let's get past the. Cool, so there fun. should be like Zendikar uh, on Zendikar on Zendikar on Zendikar on Zendikar on, and then they have um, two foils, one of each. Oh, okay, so cool. So you get the island, which that was the, that's the sought-after island, actually. Oh, is yeah, it? Yeah, that was the expensive island. And then the planes, which is my favorite planes artwork of all time, I think, from this John Avon. This is one of the planes I really like. And was there someone else that's complaining about these, too, because there's, like, Trace Nilsson in these? No, these are all John Avon and Noah. Oh, Noah Bradley. Noah Bradley. Okay, Bradley. that's what everyone was complaining about. They're all Noah Bradley lands. I see. And yeah. he's now a, a band artist. All right, let's go to the next... Uh, or the box. This is for Dr. Duck Butter. He specializes in ducks and butter. Yeah. And ducking butter. There's some sort of connotation with that, I'm sure. Who knows? Who knows? Who cares? All right. So, Double Masters. We'll have Zach open up one. We'll kind of do how we, we do with it. Let's go with the box stopper. Uh oh, hopefully that's not damaged. Oh, what can happen? Oh. So it has the same problem that uh, Ultimate yeah. Masters. They didn't well, learn their lesson from that. I. They, they are getting they damaged care. cards from this from being loose. But it's caused. Uh, it looks like. No, it's this old. could be. This could be damaged. It yeah. could be. Careful. They uh -huh. suck at. There you go. Yeah. Let's see. So far, it's okay. So I'm sure people will get some damaged ones out of their boxes with how that one was. Yeah. Where it just it just shifts around so much in there. So this one's okay, and it's a lightning grease, and we have the sniffing dark confidant. We have the Joe Ooh. Biden dark confidant. It's also off centered, where the, the cards to the side there. I guess they wanted to really center in on that weird thumb that's there. At the yeah. right. Look at all this blank space in the middle where <laughs> it should be, where they, whoever that the person that actually puts the art into the card just didn't <laughs> count for that. Dark confidant right. and the lightning grease. Not not. These are actually two good ones here. Now right, we've pretty so much already go. gone through all the commons and everything, right? Yeah, we can go. We can go right through rare, through. the rares. Um, Let's do it. For all right, so why are they? Uh, oh, they're, we so have they're a advertising bacon, the a bacon of unrest. Did you see that? They're advertising their VIPs. Oh, they're advertising in their things when this is coming out when yes. there's no more supply. And a Tuck Tuck. So the first pack for me is pretty horrible. Oh, I got and Inkwell, a, Abiathan, a and... Brand. Oh, the, oh, I got an Oblivion Stone foil. What was your foil? 
Uh, I guess Oblivion a, still a crappy nothing comment. anymore. Yeah, because it was. Was this in one of the? Yes, it was in one of the master sets. Mystery is a foil. Oh, maybe it was in the. I was don't it, think it was a, it foil a foil in the mysteries. Oh, it was in another it was master set. Regular. Yeah, because I know some kid just traded that in. Yeah, uh, an iconic version. Yeah, it was iconic, I think, and it was worth like nothing. The foil even. So. All right. Guess we can see what some of. The, are there any good uncommons at this point? Ion Storm, sad. No. I rare. have the Rugged Prairie, which this one actually was a double, was a second reprinting. Because yep. Iconic Master has had some, but not all. And this was one they did have, was a Rugged Prairie. And that's a good one. We got the Archangel Food. I mean, it's Mythic's getting hit, hit hard, but it's a really fan favorite for sure. And another kind of terrible foil in the Vidalcan Infuser. And, oh, we had two foils. I don't even notice what the other yes, foil was. In I think so. Oh, wow. I'm so sorry. Scavenge Born Hydra. Oh, it was a Conclave National. Oh, man. Ba Baskill's Collar got printed again, so that's was not that going to be worth anything. Yes. And it was in Ma it was Modern in Masters one, 17 3. Or, or yeah, 3. yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's in it. yeah, I know it. that's wow. where it got its price killed was in that. And this pack did not want to rip cleanly. I wanted to rip to the side, and now oh, I can't we'll get it We'll get open. you one going. We got an orb. Oh, Warm Coil Engine. Expert, Expedition ah, map. map. As a foily? Yeah, mm -hmm. but a worm coil engine, so that might be $10 now. All right, so Cord of Calling. So you can get those as promos and in the set, I guess. Yep. Isn't Cord the bio, bio box promo I that we guess. still have and won't get till August 18th? Uh, that's insane. Oh, Grim Wild Master. Talk about a card that's been crushed oh, in wow. value. Mystery. Yeah, So there's a mystery. True. It's now about a 50 cent, 70, 75 cent rare. Wow. And then we have the Crib Swap. That's a cool popper downshift, I believe. And the Glaze Fiend. That's a fun popper card. All right. And look at that. There you There's go. a doubling season. Doubling season from the and Modern Masters. And we've got... Ooh, that would be perfect <laughs> yeah, no. to draft look with. Look at that. Look at that. Look at those two oh, going together. I, you'd have to take those two. No foils even worth mentioning. Oh, yeah. Are the rares meant to be played together? I no, don't I don't think know. so. Right? I thought that was something in uh, Zendikar with their new... Yeah, their set boosters. Yeah. Okay, so let's the get cards the fun stuff. Nice, There's a Mrs. Though. Bobble. Doesn't come with the Metamorphos next to it. Finally, so they don't, don't feel that. like plastic. They feel like old school magic. Stone Hewer Giant, another card that's got crushed in value. And Bosch. Ooh. With a Sylvan Might and a Clone Shell. All right, and she can play some Commander now with the Arbiter, another Oblivion Stone. The Chat of the squirrels. squirrels. Okay, get right to the juicy stuff. The Masterwork of Ingenuity. And it's going to be Stone Force Mystic to go with it. Nope, for Exxion Metamorph. At least it can copy, copy. You can you can copy, copy, and then copy. You can, or you can play in equipment, copy it, and then copy it again with Phyrexian Metamorph. And Wait a second, why Tower. is that a common? I oh, Urza's Tower is rare in this set. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that, what? I like that foil, though. It kind of it pops. Yeah, it does. Oh, wow. This box is pretty freaking cool. There's a Force of Will and a Sneak Attack. We saw another, yeah, we oh, saw yeah, another force. pack today. Yeah, with force and sneak attack with in it. With force and sneak yep. attack in it, so. Wow. Wow, These... that's kind of interesting. 100%. Right. That's 100% that it was open. 100%, the exact same thing. I don't remember where the foils were or anything. Uh -uh. But yeah. That, yeah, that was. Yeah, the, that rare did come together. So, huh. Kevin's not allowed to open can... up packs anymore, I think. I wonder if these can get mapped. I don't know if anyone knows if that has been. Um, Manamorphs and Lightning Greaves together. That's kind of cool. All right, we got the Thoughtseize mm. with Merciless Eviction. Oh. And then a Foil Cathartic Reunion would be worth something if Chandra Spellbook wasn't a thing. And first Foil Rare is uh, second. the... Oh, you got one too? It was a Fire Yeah, Thicket, the Oblivion Stone. Which I don't think was in Iconic. Maybe it was. Well, there's a Bluffs and an Aristocrat Teamer Battle Rage. Foil Teamer? How much is Teamer even worth anymore? Um, Nothing? I think it's the third reprinting of it now. I might be wrong. Maybe this is the first. No, I swear it was reprinted before. Yeah, I and think it was. Teamer. I thought it was in Mystery Packs. Maybe. Maybe that's what I'm thinking of. All right, so we got the Deep Glow uh, Skate, which I think was a double reprinting of Mystery, now this. And the Tempered Steel with Agrivian mm. and Tumble Maggot. Magnet. I did get an, uh, an oblivion. Blah, 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 blah. Oubliette. Can talk? It's, Oubliette. Yeah. Spell Sky, Spell Sky, which is like nothing now. And, uh, Walking Band Blasta card. just got banned today. Yep. And so that's kind of sad. Plus, he's been reprinted again. Man, so the smell look. of these are even weirder. I can't. Oh, my. They're not like Mystery Pugnet, but they have a smell to them. Sorry, have... sorry, Duck. We're smelling your cards. They smell like something that I put in my car the other day. Yeah. Like. 
some sort of I bet it's that they, they didn't hire something. someone to, to make it so the cards don't warp as much. And they have been doing a better job. Goblin Guide and Grand Architect, which had the double mystery printing. And the Salivating Gremlins and the Heartless Village. And I'm the only one going to open up any more of the oh, packs. Yeah, because I know. I'm there's getting Explore, I'm getting the Wrath of God. Terrible stuff. And nothing good on foil-wise. Yeah, a lot of people said they were um, impressed with the common slot. I haven't been. The common yeah. slot's weird. It's like... I don't know. Let me look through some of these. The value's just not there. There's Urza's Mind. Yeah, there's just... Legion of the Tangle downshifted from Mythic. The Conjurer's Closet. Pognify and the Mirror Smith. All right. Well, there's a Twilight. Out this, this Force of Will, man. Greater this box good. Is, what is it? Force of Will and then Dark Confidant? No, that no. was Dark Confidant was in the VIP pack. Because uh, I thought it was still um, mana. Um, oh, not mana. No, no, no. We haven't had a crypt. I'm oh, saying no, the Valley in this box. Yeah, we had doubling Force season. of Will, Doubling Season. Not terrible. And... Not terrible. I'm not seeing anything too crazy. We got the Lesbian the Stage. Shops. The Geth Lord of the Vaults, the bulk mythic out of the set, Ooh. and the fairy mechanist, and a downshifted bone. Oh, yeah, because Geth got Commander 29 reprinted. Ah, I see. All right, Boon Reflection. And an ink moth. Blink moth. Why isn't that ink moth? They just reprinted this. <sighs> Not really. Well, I guess it was a little while Blink ago. Blink moth is just kind of. only like five bucks. Yeah, it's just. It's worse. Yeah, it's pretty low. Really low. Because one of my failed specs was Blink moth that I thought was going to go up. All right, let's see here. We have Riku of Two Reflections. So he's probably five bucks now, right? Gonna, it's going to go that low for sure. And Sculpting Steel. Wait, doesn't doesn't Masterwork in ingenu Ingenuity do copies and equipment? This copies yeah. an artifact, and so does Rexy Metamorph. Yeah. My brain hurts. Why so many in one set? I don't know. And a foil ever flowing chalice, which got a, a downshifting to popper, and a death re ritual, which used to be a very expensive conspiracy foil. Last Wind pack. Reflection and champion another Lambles. champion. And it's a stirrings and exactly. rapacious dragons. So that's well, that box wasn't terrible. We had some no. good pulls here. And we definitely have some good ones. We have a couple other VIPs that we will be opening on a separate video, and then we're going to have Bacon Bombs with his massive opening of the VIPs once we actually get them in when our distributors decide to send them to us, Bo. Oh, oh, all in all, not terrible cards here. Oh. I mean, definitely powerful cards in our yes. Double Masters. We'll be interesting to, see how to it draft. Sells. Oh, yeah. I want to draft this so much. Why are we yeah. open? We should have drafted Duck Butter's box. Just to draft his box yeah. and say too bad. Yeah. Well, let's just do a two-player draft. Uh, with that, that's true. It's true. Uh, each open up 12 packs. No, two-player draft is you, you put them in two piles. Oh, yeah. They have yes. three piles of cards. And then each time someone decides not to take a card from a pile, then you add a card to it from the top I of one see. of those two I random see. piles. It's kind of fun. Can't well. remember what they call it, a Winston draft or something. Yeah, there you have it. Like I said, be looking forward to more of these box opening videos for the Double Masters. We apologize again for Paul for being such terrible openers, but that's what happens yes. when you have me open anything. Again, Zach should have actually touched the pack. Man, this mat's picking up everything. I love it, though. I don't know why. It is awesome gorgeous. Awesome mat. We love this mat from the Game Genic mat. Yes, it's probably my favorite map now. So, yep. All right, well, is that it? Yep, that's it for now. Kevin. And Zach. With Goddard Gabes. Thanks for watching.